Hey everybody, my name is Becky and I welcome you to my muscle function video series. Today I want to go over the extensor halicus longus muscle. I will go over its location which includes the origin and insertion, followed by its function, and then finally providing you an exercise or two so you know how to strengthen this muscle. So let's get started with the location on the muscle and then we'll build from there. The origin or the starting point of the extensor halicus longus muscle is located on the middle two-thirds of the anterior surface of your fibula and then runs down along the front of your shin and crosses the ankle and insert, inserts onto or ends on the distal phalanx just just before the toenail of the big toe. Okay, so just so you know where this muscle is on my body, I'm going to go ahead and point it out for you and then I'll provide you with an illustration. So I'm going to just zoom in here for you so you can see a little bit better for this particular demonstration. So hang on. Okay, so again, the origin of the extensor halicus longus muscle is on the middle two-thirds of the anterior surface of your fibula and that bone is closer to the outside of your lower leg here so it is right in here is where it starts and then this muscle runs down and crosses your ankle joint and comes down and then inserts onto the distal phalanx on the big toe that is right before the toenail okay as you can see here okay so what I'm going to go ahead and do is provide you with an illustration so you know exactly what I'm talking about right here okay so now that we know the exact location of the extensor halicus longus muscle on our bodies now I'm going to go ahead and move on to its functions. So the first function is a major function of this particular muscle is extension of the big toe. The second function of this muscle, which is also a major function, is dorsiflexion of the ankle. And then lastly, the third function is an assisting movement. So this muscle just assists with movement it is inversion of the foot. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and attach a few examples of what those motions look like right here. Okay, so functions of this muscle again are as follows. We have extension of the big toe. We also have dorsiflexion of the ankle. And then we also have inversion of the foot. So I'm going to go ahead now and move on to a few examples of what you can do for exercises in order to strengthen this muscle. So here they are. Okay, so the first exercise that you can do, you can take a resistance band and wrap around the foot. Now if it's too long you can double it up and then use the bottom portion and loop it around the other foot okay and then what you can do is you can practice dorsiflexions on that foot another way that you can strengthen this muscle would be through walking on the heels of your feet. So again, this would be walking on the heels of the feet. So it's more of an isolation, or I'm sorry, an isometric exercise. Okay, 
Okay, you guys, that's all I have for today. I am thankful that you stopped by and watched another muscle function video. Um, I hope you stay for next week. If you found value in the video, give it a thumbs up. Pass it on with a share. Maybe tell a friend about it. Um, maybe uh, help a classmate out that may not understand the particular muscle. But anyways, thank you again for watching, and I will see you all again next week.